A school fight caught on camera involving a staffer and a student. It's our top story at 6. Thanks for joining us. I'm Lauren Thompson. And I'm Sherry Jones. The Holt School District says it's investigating tonight after the scene at a high school there today. Daryl and Horn is here for you now with what happened and what will happen next. Daryl Yes, Lauren and Sherry, one student says the situation is just sad. And no matter what led up to the incident, another parent tells me fighting between kids and adults is never okay. That's crazy. I'm still in shock. Just believe that that even happened. The video shows a student hitting a staff member in the lunchroom and a fight follows. So for her to go and assault a minor, there's it's wrong on all points. She should not have punched that lady, of course. But as adults, they should know better than to incite and intimidate. Lexi's a sophomore at Holt High School. She says a group of students were heard using a racial slur amongst themselves when a member of the lunch staff told them to stop. So she went from behind the counter up to them and kind of was yelling at them in their face kind of thing, which I think is completely unacceptable. Then she says the slur was used again. She said, how would you like it if I called you? And then she said it. Yeah. A one kid next to her, a guy punches her in the face. And the other um, lunch lady, she comes in and she just starts beating on this kid. And she was, as far as I'm concerned, she was not involved in that interaction at all. One parent calls it unacceptable behavior from a staff member. What's going on with our youth in our schools? <laughs> the people they hiring, you know what I'm saying? Like, that's crazy. You should be able to control yourself in any situation with kids. So. I don't know. It's sad for everyone, and it's hard on everyone. So that's all there is, really. The Ingham County Sheriff's Office says a police report was filed, but referred any other comments to the school district. The district would only release this written statement saying safety is their highest priority and that they're interviewing everyone to find out exactly what happened. Sherry.